guys, Phil London here, and I'm gonna be doing a quick workout right in my apartment, and I'm gonna be featuring two things today. Uh, Hint Water, and it's the blackberry flavor. They're gonna be at HealthWorks on June 15th, collaborating with me for my event. It's a Pilates Fusion with a resistance band, so check them out. So I'll be hydrating with that. And today I'm gonna be working with 3.3 pound body bars. There's going to be more information about the name of these bars and the actual real bar uh, coming soon. These are just the prototype. So they feel like 3.3 pound weights, um, but they have a nice soft foam in the middle. And I'm just going to be using them instead of dumbbells, kettlebells, or toning balls today. So go ahead if you have two pound weights at home or three pound weights at home, that's fine. Or you can use your toning balls, but today I'm just going to try these out. So I'm gonna put the bars right on top of each upper arm and I'm gonna turn my feet out a little bit and I'm just gonna do a sumo squat just to warm up. I wanna exhale when I come up, just warming up the hip joint, trying to get nice and low, down and up. And we're gonna be doing about 12 reps. So let's go four more. I wanna keep the neck nice and neutral. So the next exercise is just a little different. We're gonna have the arms in a flex position away from the body. We're exhale pressing down. So pushing out and down. It is different than the other exercise that you're gonna see in a few minutes that was featured in my other arm sculpting. This is meant to do your arms and legs at the same time, no breaks. Here I'm just doing a plie. Standing on one leg, I'm gonna go ahead and do my arm circles. Switch legs and direction. Working with eight or 12 reps. If you need to take a break, please do. I'm gonna turn side for this next one. I'm gonna put all my weight on my front leg. I just have this leg lightly down back here. We're gonna go up, shoulder press, press, and down. Up, shoulder press, press, and down. Try and stay hinged over, push, good. Now the length of these bars make it more challenging than just a dumbbell because the lever length is more challenging. So you can increase speed, you can increase lever length, you can increase resistance, all to make the exercise more challenging. Also, I use choreography a lot to make it more challenging. Now switch legs and continue. but just adding the length to this bar really challenges the body. So I actually increased my weights here to 3.3 and my lever length. Up, these are killer. Wow, that is challenging. Okay, we're gonna go down into an isometric plie hold. We're gonna do two pulses in and a press. Two pulses in and a press. Good. So an exercise I do every week in body shop 
and then sometimes repeat in my Pilates class at the end of the workout is my plie overhead tricep shoulder press combo. So the idea lately is I love to arm sculpt. Everybody has been asking me for arm sculpts and why not incorporate the legs? But why don't we fit it in with leg work? These are really heavy guys. <laughs> the body bars are really heavy. Woo, yeah. And Two more. And so you're wise because I said so. <laughs> Push, pull. So if you're used to using the twos, jumping to 3.3 pounds is a killer. <laughs> oh my God, I'm gonna be sore. Definitely fitting it in. You know, it's Monday, Memorial Day. I was out of town for a couple of days, then I came back and I had a little barbecue with my friends. Today it's rainy. I did grocery shopping and some food prep. And now it's like four o'clock, just finished watching Dr. Phil. That's not a joke. And now I'm just fitting in some arm sculpt and strength. new to arm sculpting diagonal swings which with these body bars make it perfect because look at how you can hold them <sighs> holy crap this is very challenging betsy told me earlier she was sweating from my workout and i do believe her now and <sighs> side guys use that core obliques I did increase to 12 I don't know what I'm thinking increase the resistance change the movements increase the lever length of the resistance and increase the number of reps but I'm ready because I have been working out a lot lately Getting in shape for the summer. And next exercise. So we're gonna squat and press. Squat and press. Squat and press. Squat and press. And just kind of letting that arm go down, press down, one's a bicep, one's a lift, down, lift, down, lift, four, lift, three, lift, two, and one, switch sides, it's bicep, press, left bicep, arm press, bicep, lift, down, lift, and up, down, up, good guys, push, and abs nice and tight, four, two, one, into your plie hold, down, this is different than that other plie one where you were going down and up, this is like the newest arm sculpting video that I was in my kitchen, with the toning balls. If you can't turn your thumbs all the way down, don't worry about it. You could just press it out. Find the way you can work out <sighs> safely and effectively. Push. Good. Hold those legs down. Down. And 
Good. Push. Nice. Two. One. Quickly. Now some of these exercises are in my body bar routine that I have for sale that's gonna be coming available soon. Call this the Ferris wheel, down and up. Swing down and up, down and up. You can do this with dumbbells too. I do love these body bars for this. Kettlebell would be nice too. Good, awesome. Obliques, try to go straight down in the legs and other direction. Guys, this is not fake news. <laughs> okay, this is not fake news. Guys, this isn't fake news. You can hear my heart rate here. Good. Nice. Push. Two. And one. Awesome. Nice job, guys. Literally shaking. I'll see you guys soon.